Hello, today we're going to be solving a system of linear equations using Python, specifically the library NumPy. The reason we're using NumPy is because it's, first of all, optimized for speed, saving you time, and second, has a lot of pre-built-in methods, uh, such as uh, numpy.matrix, which will allow you to have matrices and give you the freedom to be able to multiply them without worrying about are the elements multiplying um, row times column, et cetera, et cetera. And it gives you the advantage of uh, having a linear algebra part of this library that allow you to find the inverse, find the determinant uh, very quickly and efficiently, saving you time. So the first step to solving system linear equations using Python is to put into matrix form. So in our equation, 1a plus 1b equals 35, the coefficients 1 and 1 in 1a plus 1b will become the coefficients going across the first row of our matrix A, 1, 1, and in our second equation, 2a plus 4b equals 94, the 2 and the 4 will go in the second row of matrix A. And eventually, when you put it into matrix form, you'll get your matrices in the form of A times X equals B. So this is A, this is X, and this is B. To solve this equation, to isolate x, we have to times both sides of the equation by A inverse. The reason we're doing this is A inverse times A is the identity matrix, and in the end, which it'll isolate our matrix x, and x will be equal to A inverse times B. So to do this in Python, first we're going to import numpy as, sorry, import numpy as np. The second thing, we're going to define our matrices. I don't even know how to spell that, but whatever. So a equals np dot matrix. Uh, and matrix is a method of numpy. And going across the first row of a, again, we have 1, 1. And in the second row, we'll have 2, 4. And if you want to check to make sure we entered it right, you can just print it out. And we were correct. And entering in matrix B, we have np dot matrix. And going across the first row of B, we have 35. And in the second row, we have 94. And I'm going to print that out just to check. Okay. Uh, the second thing is, since we want to isolate x in the equation, we have to find the inverse of a. So inverse of a. So sec a underscore inverse is equal to np. The dot uh, lin alg is just a linear algebra part of the NumPy library, which has a lot of useful methods such as uh, finding the inverse, find the determinant, et cetera, et cetera. And if you want to just find the inverse for some reason, you can just print out the variable a underscore inverse, and that is a inverse. And to find the solution to this problem, uh, i.e. solving for x, all we have to do is, like before, um, have x equal to a inverse times b, and we'll have x equal to a score inverse times the matrix b, and this will give us the solution to our problem. And assuming I can print, and print x, and that's the solution to our problem. If you want to get access to this code, uh, I left the link in the description. And all you have to do is go to my GitHub and uh, download the zip file, or you could uh, get cloned, but that's a whole other matter. As well as if you want to do something else in NumPy or in Python in particular, this linear algebra part of the NumPy library is wonderful. 
has pre-built-in functions. It's faster than if you just wrote a for loop. It's amazing. Uh, check it out. And thank you so much for your time. Have a great day.